Hey guys, welcome back to Home Reviews. In this video, we're gonna be looking at the SmartBot. This is a half horsepower submersible utility pump and it works amazing. I've already used it to drain my hot tub once. Here in a minute, I'm gonna put it together, uh, some of these attachments here, hook it up to my water hose. I'm gonna put it in my hot tub so you guys can see how well this thing actually pumps out water. Now, before we jump into this, let's look at this box for a minute to give you a breakdown of what all this thing has to offer. This is the Robust 2800, and after you guys see this thing work, you'll probably wanna pick it up yourself, so I'm gonna put the link below the video for that. It says here it can remove up to 2,800 gallons per hour, and it has an anti-clog feature where it automatically shuts off to prevent breakdowns from clogging. And if we look at this side, you can see here that it even has a US patent on the auto flow for auto on off operation. It senses as soon as you set this thing down in water, it turns on, and as soon as the water's down to, uh, let's see here, 1 16th of an inch, it will automatically turn off. And you can see over here, it flows continuously even when knocked over. And of course, this is as long as it's surrounded by water. Ways you can use this thing, you can use it in your basements, yards, on-ground pools, hot tubs, bathtubs, flat roofs, window wells, and ponds. So for me, uh, I'm gonna be using it in my hot tub. And here you can see the overall performance and the accessories that comes with it and the sizes so you know exactly if it's gonna fit yours or not. For me, I'm just gonna be using a water hose so what I'm gonna do is if we look at this thing and turn it around, you can see here it has a place where you can either insert this adapter and this one will obviously just take it straight out. Or if you want to pump it up, you want to use this adapter. So this is the one I'm gonna use. I'm gonna go ahead and put this on here. And now that we have that on, I'm gonna take this one here, the smallest adapter, because this is what I'm using for my water hose. And we'll go ahead and screw that on here. And they have really nice rubber seals that go around it. So you want to tighten it snug, but you don't want to over tighten it. So just a couple good twists after it's tight there and that should do it. So I'm gonna go ahead and take this outside now to my hot tub and the wind is blowing really bad outside. So hopefully that's not gonna interfere with setting this up, but um, I'll show you guys how this works. All right, here we are outside. This is my hot tub. This is a huge hot tub. I think it's around 450 gallons. And this pump drained this thing the other day in less than 10 minutes. So what I'm gonna do is I got the other end of the water hose here. I'm gonna drop it in here and you guys can see just how fast this thing pumps out water. So let me go ahead and try to do this. I'm gonna take this pump. And as soon as we set it down in there, it kicks on. There's nothing else we have to do. So let me just set it down in there. We'll give it just a second. And there you go. And it's a it's a pretty good stream too. I mean, you can you can see it's really pushing that water out. And of course, if you had just using the bigger attachments with a bigger hose, it would be it'd be pushing out more water than this. Now, the only thing that I do wish, I wish the extension cord was longer. Uh, down there, you can see where it connects into my cord. I don't know exactly how long this cord is, but uh, if I was wanting to drop this thing down in my pool to drain it, I'd, I would want that cord to be longer. It doesn't matter if it's on its side. You can see down there if it's on its side or not. If it falls over, maybe you're trying to uh, clean out a basement or something, if this thing falls over, it's, it's still going to run and drain that water. And then once you take it out, make sure you grab it by the handle, don't grab it by the cord because the thing is pretty heavy. And after you give it just a few seconds, it realizes there is no more water. <clears throat> and it turns off just like that. So overall, this thing is amazing. I can't even tell you guys, I've bought two or three other pumps before because we have a big in-ground pool that's closed by a dome here. And it takes a pretty good sized pump to pump water out of that to get it ready to close in the winter. And the other pumps I've bought from local department stores, they just couldn't even come close to comparing to what this smart bot can do. So regardless of whether you're wanting to pump out a hot tub, a pool, a basement, uh, or just get rid of water wherever. Um, I'm going to highly recommend you guys check this out because 
um, it definitely works very, very good. Once again, I'll put that link below this video if you guys want to go get more details or even pick it up.